posted this here of her daughter her toddler is lashing out hitting and she shared this to her 5 million followers and the first thing I thought when I saw this was why why would she do this well she did it because she thought it was cute I'm telling you right now though this is not cute these little kids won't be little forever but the habits you teach them the behavior you teach them that can last forever or at least a very long time it could definitely have long-lasting impact this is how you instill bad behavior into a child at a young age. You know who don't think this is funny? People who deal with the results of it. The early childhood professionals and the education professionals at the elementary and middle schools listen to their conversations about all the behavioral issues that they have to put up with every day. The education professionals who have to spend more time babysitting and trying to tame bad students than teaching. The bus drivers that gotta put up with a bunch of kids at once while also making sure they stay safe on these dangerous roads with a bunch of crazy adults driving with no patience. This is not cute. Just like I always say a lot of people are not qualified for marriage, a lot of people are also not qualified for children. Their kids are running around without any discipline, no guidance. That's because they're not being raised right. They raise them like this. Then they post it up on social media for giggles, when really it's nothing even funny about it. Nah, I'm sorry, this is out of order. And the only thing that could be just as bad as an out of control adult is an out of control kid. This is how you get bad children like the ones on the school bus in Ohio, or like the students who had that fight down in Louisiana with over 200 people. And then you have women talking about how they need more man energy in schools after these organizations and institutions and all the women running them have been consciously working to keep men out of there for years. Now, I've covered a lot of school bus incidents here. And you know with that latest one, the woman who was forced to quit, basically fired after she went off on the students on the school bus. Her GoFundMe is still rising. She raised over $115,000. If you missed that video where I reported all the details on that incident, along with the teacher who walked out in the middle of class, go ahead and click right here and watch that video now. Until next time, everybody out there, take care.